hit big on Bovada when he gets back on there, 12 12 for the other song. That's what I'm actively thinking of, 12 12. That's what I'm actively thinking of. Yes, 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 yes. You know what it is? My manifestations be to where it's like I'm trying to talk myself into doing work for bigger money so I can start slow because I know it's like this um system is like that like you have to have a job but that's what everybody's getting out of everybody's an entrepreneur nowadays so it's like of course I want to do that too but I want to have a stable plan so I know I have to um get my big monies first and then like invest in myself but I was going to say something else, but fuck it. I, I'm going to wait because I, I just be making videos and after videos. And I said I was going to do, like, my separate, like, herb videos. So, I might as well, yeah. Shit, since we're only a minute in, this, this can be my um, herb video. So, let's get into Mullion and Lavender since that's what me and Jalil are doing. So, I'm going to do two, I guess, since that's what we're doing. So, me and Jalil, we be smoking mullion and lavender to benefit us because we are smokers, but, <clears throat> excuse me, it's to benefit us. Like, we drink the teas as well for the um, the mullion because it does help your lungs. And with um, lavender, lavender helps with insomnia and it actually calms you down. Like, it, it's a soothing herb. And you can grow it yourself too. It's very easy to grow and I don't have any plants, so you don't have to listen to me, but hey, I know it works, so you can do your own research, but I know so far I've been using lavender, and it's been pretty well for me, because I was trying to talk him into it to actually use to smoke for um, him, since he smokes on um, blacks and stuff, it's like, okay, uh, I want to help his lungs, so I really wanted to get mullion more than mugwort, because I used to be on mugwort here, but I need to get um, more of that too, mugwort, it's going to be for another one because I already talk about that. Oh, I used to talk about that a lot before I started um, studying more on the other herbs. So, mullion, it helps um, your lungs when it comes to mucus. It gets mucus out. It helps with mucus buildup. The mucus can actually be coughed up a lot or come out of your nose because I've noticed that with me mullion it mostly comes out in gunks of like my nose like sorry uh, for the yeah the nasty but i'm not showing anything so it don't matter um jalil he coughs more way more than me and sometimes it's like a like damn you're right and it's like yeah but it's also beneficial because he's getting that all out because he said that he don't really blow his nose it mostly comes out of his mouth so it's like the opposite for me i i blow my nose um more because i mean yeah we're smoking the mullion but before then yeah we would we would still be clogged up sometimes just because of the dust like we noticed the dust so we were cleaning more of dust rather than like you know tidying just tidying up because we don't we're not dirty so it's just like when the dust build up in the corners that shit really do be in the fans a lot like our fans uh that we plug in because we like it cold like we had an air on and then we have fans and a ceiling fan so it's like yeah it's just one of those so we got all that going on it can um cause that as well so the smoking helps and the teas used to whenever um he used to get sick because jalil the thing is he gets sick more he get he used to get sick more than me because i noticed he doesn't actually get sick as much now like, he'll have a little cold here and there, but he used to, like, get sick back to back, and I've noticed that, and when I started getting into the herbs, it's like, yeah, I'm gonna take them, and it does benefit me. I used to not get sick as much, but since I've now, like, with the allergies and COVID, like, when they, they starting to put more shit into the air, it's like, yeah, you have to uh, take care of yourself. Like, not only in the air, but in, like, what we consume, because I noticed that we do, uh, look and feel better when it comes to of course drinking water but also we we went a day without eating one time like it was just one we just had one of those like you know we were just going through it a little bit but also <laughs> we were still like the slim like we were slimming fast because our metabolism is still fast but it's not as fast as when we were in high school and we noticed that because when we eat the fatty foods and fast food it does create mucus as well a lot of things that we consume creates mucus and also with the uh, water, we were just drinking like straight water. 
it was cleansing us out more and more because I drink coffee as well. So that shit is just like, not necessarily not real, but you know, anyways. <laughs> so yeah, with that, it helped too with my digestion, I've noticed because I'm still doing my research on it, but I know it's not bad for you. Like it don't matter. Herbs are not bad for you. A lot of anything is bad for you. So just know how to consume it. Like what I do, I take a pinch, like we pinch it and do that pinch in our um in our roll and that's it like we just roll that together and if we want to make a thicker one that was when i will get the uh lavender i thought i had it over here oh yeah i did well i do so this is a little bit of the lavender i don't have the mulling with me it's in his car because we smoke more of the mulling and more than the lavender so yeah this is the lavender it looks a little dirty just because it's it looked like she got the bottom of the barrel but she didn't it's on um, the powder but I low-key feel like uh, with the hippie store, since it is, like, owned by a white dude, he owns a lot of it around here. Well, a lot of the places around here, these herbs don't look um, all the way, like, clean. Because the thing is, yeah, like, I, I know they're um natural, but it's like, I know last time I got lavender didn't look like that. So, what, well, the last couple times, it's like, it's, it keep looking different. I don't know what y'all doing. Like, I don't know if it's dirty herb, you know, little reggie herb. <laughs> But it's fine, you know, it's still hit, so I'm glad that it's still, like, an actual thing. It's better than uh, the fake lavender that I got, because um, Jalil, I'm glad he got me something, first of all, because I am appreciative of him giving me, like, this big box of herbs, because I did use some of it. I, I used to smoke some of it, but then when I actually was reading the artificial flavoring and shit, I was just like, yeah, and I told him about it. But I still was using it um, before I noticed, so it's like, okay, I'm good, um... I'll just use like the natural herbs that, that I can put in my teas. Cause when I put in the tea, it tasted weird. So it's like, why do y'all even have to put, y'all always got to put some extra shit. Y'all got to put y'all extra oomph, fake oomph in it. It's natural. Leave it the fuck alone. And it didn't even make it better. Like I would get it if they try to sweeten up uh, with artificial flavoring, but it wasn't, it was bare lavender, artificial lavender. Why do y'all have to make it artificial? Just give us the real shit. It's not that hard, you know, but you know, they're not on our team. So don't ask me who they is, because I don't, I'm not doing that, but, um, <laughs> um, yeah, let's get back into it, so, lavender, lavender with the soothing thing, it's, like, more so of, um, I'll say for anxiety, really, like, that's why I feel like it's, uh, it's a better, um, herb to start with if you are not, if you're just like getting into it because i still call myself a beginner because i have a whole list of herbs but i'm still getting into the details of what they do because i'll have a list and then some of them like in my notes it won't have nothing beside it so it's like i'm still getting into it but the ones that i do that i keep writing down i'm gonna remember it and i also i recommended this book um please don't fall <laughs> i recommended this book before and i'm gonna do it again <laughs> I'm going to always recommend this book. Okay, you learned there's a lot of stuff in here. <laughs> there's a lot of stuff. I'm sorry. <laughs> there's a lot of stuff um, in, in that book that you can learn, really, like, literally. 1221 on the clock. Yes, sir. I've been seeing a lot of angels. Never, I haven't been saying them. So whatever sticks out to me, I'm going to say them because I know I've been seeing them a lot. But yeah, 1221, um, one of the, the Trusted Herd app hit me up and was like, oh, we got a job for you. And it's because they didn't send me notifications. I don't know how, but it's like I missed it. And it was like, oh, because I kept seeing 1221. I'm like, what does the number mean? Take that leap of faith, y'all. Okay, y'all keep saying that. Well, what? Faith? Oh, well, not faith, but what? Leap of faith. I do have faith. But it's like, what? Leap of faith? Like, what am I jumping into? Like, just tell me. Let me know. 909 on the clock. Like, I've been seeing that, too, recently. So, it's like 1222 as well. Uh, at different times, though. Like, not back to back. Because it's like, you know, me watching the clock. Because I catch myself doing that sometimes. And I don't like it. Because it's like, you forcing it. Just, you know. When I see it all around me, that's when it's like getting crazy but back to what i was saying so with the 1221 i came back the next week with the number seeing it over and over but i couldn't connect to anything and as soon as i was like let me just check every app every email every anything notification because sometimes they i don't get the notification they'll be in my spam emails or you know so i'm just checking everything make sure i don't miss nothing no opportunities boom 1221 
p.m. was when they messaged me last week about a job opportunity and I set up a zoom I was able to set up a zoom 10 on one for um next week but I could have but for this week but I'm still glad that I'm able to regardless like it's not it wasn't too late it was just like uh it's just a week you know but it's like you know just got I gotta keep checking my stuff because I've been getting messages like just keep checking your stuff like it don't matter what day it don't matter what type of day you think you're having 10 23 do it like do it because me and Julia was talking about that yesterday too when the day started getting better like you know it's just one of those like we just got to push ourselves to do stuff now because it's like if I don't feel like going to the gym just go to the gym and I'm just like yeah I get it because I know how it gets sometimes for us individually and together because it's like yeah let's get back on that shit man I sound just like going <laughs> yeah yes 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 I just feel better you know it's just one of those. And I'm probably trying to talk myself into taking a nap. But every time I try to talk myself into taking a nap, he pops up. So it's like, oh, well, I could just stay up longer because I just get tired. And I'm sitting here. But I'll probably watch my YouTube. I'm not really tired. It's just like I feel good, relaxed. Because I did smoke lavender just then. So, amen. Amen. Say amen. <laughs> I was gonna say I know that ain't him. It's another white car, <laughs> but yeah. I um also with the lavender. I was gonna say something else. Let me just go to my notes, cause I do I do be writing it down more than what I can remember. I just remember like the most important like for people because a lot of people deal with anxiety so lavender helps with anxiety if you're smoking vapes like if you're trying to get off smoking something that is harmful because we're doing the same like it's still kind of but we're still trying like you know we're still trying to benefit our our health regardless so i would say drink the teas if you can you can sweeten it up with honey like organic honey instead of sugar like you know if you just can't take the taste because i know when I drink my tea, some of them are spicy, like bitter, like why is it spicy, like type of shit, like why is it, what the fuck, but it's like, it be feeling good, like it do make you feel better, honestly, um, yeah, so I did that, I did put the same thing I basically said, you know, um, any questions or comments, write it down below, yeah, I wrote it in several different places, man, funny, but hey, this is, yeah, all my benefits, I put it, like, I have five different notes. Six. Forgot to count, bitch. See, I need to be nice to myself. I know how to count. But, <laughs> but yeah, that should be hilarious. I did write in my notes, like, several times. Yeah, it's good for insomnia. It's good for calming because I needed that because I do still get up. But we, we've we been smoking the money and instead of the lavender more. And I noticed that I do be smoking the lavender low-key in the daytime. That's why I'm so relaxed. I was like, girl, do that. Do it the opposite way, but I'll probably do it tonight or something. Um, I got a pee, so I'm going to go inside. And most likely come back because it is a beautiful day sitting sit in nature. Because, yes, yeah, like, it's so beautiful here. And we went to our part, our new apartment, looked at it, you know. Um, I'm so glad I got to, like, I was able to see it. And I got to, like, ride the golf cart, you know, get the little moment um at our new spot because i didn't get to last time with, since i didn't have my license so i'm glad i get to see what um what's gonna come up at least you know um yeah i gotta pee really bad this is a 13 short video since it is um a, um a learning like thing i say all of them are learning but you know how like i just jabble jabble about what i got going on the lavender and mullion video 1404 thank you Ha, <laughs> ha,